Hello everyone, my name is Ivan Liu from the University of Manchester. Today, I'm going to introduce you a novel method about generating rotatable convolutional kernel in a fully trainable way. Besides that, the model can also detect objects of different scales. Due to the character of a rotation and scale environment, the method is named as multi-angle and scale convolution, as known as MASC unit. In this work, we apply the technique on curvilinear patterns, which is, which is relatively simple to demonstrate our idea. We could find a lot of curvilinear patterns, and this feature is related to many important questions. It can be found in neural cells and axon growth. It can be found in retina vessel scan data, or even for processing the transportation maps via image method. As patterns in different orientation are closely related, our idea to leverage this self-similarity and this kernel better to be arbitrarily steerable. So, for pattern in any direction, a single pattern, a single system is enough to modeling all. Apparently, this is a more econo economy choice than training in four version, especially when problem scale become large. As a detector in different direction are internally bounded, the method can also boost accuracy and improve robustness. The idea of a steerable kernel was well developed. The steerable filters used to be very popular in image processing. Oriented bases are combined to generate the desired pattern. As its combination widths are known, arbitrary rotation effect can be achieved. The methods such as Gibor filters are widely used in edge detection and texture analysis. Come to deep learning, the seed work such as steerable ZNN using matrix operation to rotate kernel so the detection in specific direction can be achieved, and, any, and many other group theory based approach building mechanism to generate kernel groups. However, this method is usually limited by the valid range of angles, though in theory, after rotation is feasible. Problems such as complex values and estimation accuracy constrain its capability. Some other works tried to solve the problem from a classical angle. Special basis kernels are prepared. These bases are carefully designed for combination purpose, usually circular. And the bases themselves can be precisely rotated. Just apply the same set of weights on the basis of, of different directions. An arbitrary rotation effect can be, can be reached and the method is differentiable on the weights, so the model can be optimized via gradient descent, but the bases themselves cannot be updated during training. So we propose the method of multi-angle and scale convolution which is fully rotatable and completely trainable. And completely trainable. Its rotation is not based on well-designed mechanism, but taking a strategy called response shaping which uses training to balance the rotation relationship between the kernels. This image presents the structure of a MASC unit embedded model. The rotation environment is achieved by this special made kernel, and another scale environment feature is, is achieved via a parameter representation strategy of feature maps. The rotation environment detection is applied on the representation of every scale, then project the result back to the original scale using bilateral interpolation. The maximum signal among the channels at each position is selected as maximum. With these features, we made the model to be extremely light, only takes 3000 niche parameters, which is 0.6% of its counterpart. Also, great training example efficiency is observed, where the model can be trained only on 25% of training volumes to, which to achieve the equivalent performance of the benchmark such as unit variance. A MSC kernel is initialized using a Gibor generator, where the beginning patterns are precisely rotated. The kernel are internally bounded, as matrix operation is used to extend the kernel, for example, at theater direction to other four directions. Combined with the parameter representation strategy, let's say, on four different scales, a single kernel in this model can be used like 16 kernels, which made, makes the model very efficient. Not like other method, where only the maximum signal is used. The MASC unit works with training, so pressure must be applied 
in a balanced way on all directions. Otherwise, unbiased evolution on kernels will break the, re the rotational relationship. So the strategy of response shaping is introduced to solve this problem. Instead of taking simple maximum, the optimal direction response is estimated by the co covariance of the kernels, and the response shape is compared with the response shape of the input. The MASC approach can also be thought as a variant of attention. The direction kernel, the directional response vector V can be regarded as a query vector, and the optimal response matrix M can be treated as keys, unlike a typical self-attention unit. Here, the decoder of queries and the keys are the same, and the model has multiple keys to choose for each query. Also, it does not use context information to compute the keys, but with but updated with a learned bank of patterns. We tested our method on a segmentation task, where the model performs well, and the rotational relationship is maintained with pattern evolution. From the index map of response shape, we can see that, for an input pattern on a specific direction, the trace of directional kernel is also constant, and with the vessel changing in directions, the map, the map also trends in the changes index orderly. From thick to thin patterns, the model is always found to be able to work in a robust way.